I just wanted to be. I'm not coming on here to talk about drama. I'm not coming on here to talk about anyone in particular. I've said what I had to say on my community tab and I stand by that. I'm, I don't have to come on here and talk shit about people or try to cause shit to have something to talk about, mashallah. So that's not what I'm going to do. Two seconds later. Um, do I think the vet lied? How about they take her to the vet now? Like every single thing that was wrong with her is because she's fucking old, okay? Like she has kidney disease and- Even if she has kidney disease yet didn't give her treatment. Wow. She's like, if you see pictures of her, she's suffering. All for your entertainment, all to piss me off, and I'm unaffected. You're not going to bother me. I've come to terms with what happened, but that doesn't stop me from pointing out your stupid hypocrisy. All right? If you want to suck the dick of somebody who's a dumb ass and lying to you, that's your problem. Not mine. What a nasty mouth for a devouted Muslim woman. She looks, she was so bad in your care. Every single picture of her in my care is way better than she looks now. Way better. Way Ma'am, you know that's not true. You are a terrible pet owner. <laughs> Why are you in red? I like red. She's the Satan of Gore world. And yeah, Little Red Riding Hood, I still look a hundred times better than that fat goblin. Disgusting, ugly goblin. Ugliest person on it, the internet, so whatever. Don't even entertain them. That's what they want. They need it. They need it for content. They have no life. They have no life. They provoke you, and then when you act ugly back, they're like, ooh, ooh. <laughs> well, too fucking bad. I'll say what I want. Like, if I want to defend myself once in a while, I will. Whatever. Whatever, Toys R Us. Here come the Islam police. I don't care. Is she a good is she a good Jewish person? Does she do Shabbos? No, she doesn't. So kiss my ass. They're all seething with jealousy. They're so pathetic. Because every single thing they predicted and their dumb conspiracies is wrong. I'm in Kuwait. I'm in Kuwait, bitches. What are you gonna do? Huh? Ugh. I hate them. Anyway, I'm done venting. It's not worth it. I don't I don't want to talk about I don't want these stupid people in my space. Like, period. Oh, I'm aggressive, but her cackling like a witch for three hours. Witch for three hours, calling me a bitch and everything else, and my mom a whore is okay. Fuck her. She's got her karma with that. Goodbye. Yeah, I have every right to defend myself. I don't care if you're fucking bothered, then unsubscribe. I don't care. Go kiss her ass. I don't care. If anyone who was once a follower and supporter here is now over there, you never were a supporter, so goodbye. I don't care. Dumb people piss me off, and I rage, yes. You know? Oh, like 2,000 people who are in my chat are over there now because they fucking want me they want to keep discussing the old miserable me where i was being abused and i was on drugs and i was miserable that's never going to be my life again even girl shut up you were on drugs in thailand if weed was legal in kuwait you'd be high every day even if i go back to canada i'm not taking my hijab off i'm not going to go back to that life never never ever uh -uh. i'm just pointing out the bs of other people this has nothing to do with me at all you know I've already explained BBJ's pads. Why did FFG kill her dog for anxiety? You people only focus on that. I've had the cat for 20 years, and this one incident was... A you know this was not the only time. Come on now. An oversight when I was away, her nails grew long because she's fucking old. Sam's nails were fine. Okay, so shut the fuck up. They are toxic. They're gonna have no fucking channel soon anyway. Keep So enjoy this rage. Rage while you can, because you're not gonna have a channel soon, bitch. You're not gonna have one. And if you think you're going to get away with what you did with the cat, just watch. Just watch. I am proud, Rhonda. I'm very happy where I am in life. I would rather die than go back to the life I had before. Thank you. French fried squealing pig. That's what she sounds like. Squealing pig. It's funny that she has the nerve to call anyone a pig. I've never seen someone so ugly inside and outside as her ever in my life. Ignore everything she does. She's violent, abusing BBJ. Guarantee she fucking hates me. So she's, if, number one, she lied to people blatantly. But that's okay, right? That's okay. She has the cat. She's probably mistreating it. It looks starving. But the same people just who ignore that now were giving me so much shit. And those people don't matter, so who cares? But giving me shit for starving BBJ. More defamation. Like, you better pray I never go to Canada and sue your ass because I have so much, so much. Oh my God, it's insane. Like, just shut the fuck up. I seemed happier in Canada? No, not at all. Not at all. I don't know what gave you that idea. I don't know what gave you that idea. I'm sure I could come up with some clips of me crying every other day. Do you guys forget that or what? Exactly. Like, the only thing she can do is go live and rage like a pig. She rages like a pig and then friggin' Miss Wig over there does it for free now. I love that for you. Not getting paid to be a friggin' piece of crap. Love it. Disgusting people. You're not going to affect me. After this, I'm ignoring your asses. Goodbye. Keep raging about dumb shit you make up. People believe lies. None of it's true. Eventually, you're going to look stupid as fuck and your channel will be irrelevant. See ya. I can't wait for that day. <clears throat>
the fashion show. Yeah. I love how she's like, I'm at a fatty fashion show. Excuse me, ma'am. Every single fat woman, and you were fat too, egg on legs. Every single fat woman there by me was so much prettier than you in every single way. Every single way. Better dress, prettier face, everything. Everything. No, she doesn't have a boyfriend, imaginary. She just lies. Like, uh, uh, she's a fucking pathological liar. When she, I was on the phone with her one day, she told me she had like a black belt and, and freaking uh, karate. She's such an idiot. She's one of those people who have like nothing. So she tries to like assimilate her life to like bits of other people's lives. Like, ugh. Anyway, enough of that loser. That's what she, this is exactly what she wants. Imagine living, imagine living your life, hoping that someone will rage at you or address you, give you a bit of attention so they can have content. Losers. <sighs> people miss the old you well that's good for them you know because when it was the old me people were freaking out every day giving me shit you need to change your life you need to get away from that f asshole abuser you need to stop the drugs you know i wish you would just do something else other than just sit there on wheelchairs and now that i'm halfway across the world happily married to somebody who's not an abusive piece of shit now it's all oh we miss the old you and all crickets well goodbye i don't care i don't care i have no problem rebuilding an audience i have no problem continuing to do me and if you don't like it i don't care I can definitely once i saw like once all that like the rose colored glasses were off and i found out the truth when i watched sam's bar lounge videos and heard them all the shit they were talking and all this stuff stop lying you were still trying to get back with him even in kuwait and everything that happened i was just like you know that's it i i just saw and i was like i never i, I was like really made a promise to myself i will never ever let a man treat me like that ever again and then everything, like, when I look back on everything, it became the most unattractive, disgusting shit I've ever heard of in my life. Hi, Olive! Man, when they said you better not go back to Kuwait because you install it, oh, they can friggin' go circle jerk. They're stupid. Honestly. Thank you. My skin is, like, blotchy, but whatever. I'm, I have to get some Lush. I have to get some Lush because, like, you know. And I'm happy to hear that Lush stands with Palestine, so I'm definitely supporting them. Harry died, yeah, sure. Oh yeah, I'm on my eighth ham. I'm not going to Canada, so get that out of your heads. It was jealous. Oh, they could say, oh, why am I jealous of being 400 pounds? Ma'am, you're like 350, okay? So, and you're uglier, so I don't know. Thank you. <laughs> Sorry guys, wait, there we go. It's kind of messy because I was, like I said, I have to put the carpet back on the ground. <laughs> okay, so I have some onion rings.